Hold up, I see one block, uh, process another one. Panda! 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 Io su transition Il posto sta analyzed Anche finalizzato Posto How does the Ethereum match from proof of work to proof of stakes affects you? Alright Ethereum is one of the older cryptocurrencies on the block it was the first crypto to introduce its smart contracts, the tech that makes blockchains programmable, and it still hosts the lion's share of applications and projects. It goes with heavy congestion, high gas fee, and consumes as much as energy as a whole country. The solution, Hive Ethereum, a whole new engine. It needs to switch from proof-of-work model used by Bitcoin, that's BTC, and a couple of other old cryptocurrencies to the more environmental friendly and scalable proof of stake model but just as it is not easy to work on a car engine while it is racing down the freeway it is also not easy to upgrade a term system while it is still powering a large portion of the decentralized finance defi industry right now there are two systems running in parallel the Ethereum match is the point where its team essentially switches off the old system and lets the new one run it recently completed the merge on its final testnet, which is the final stage before it can make the move. The big change from Ethereum is that the proof of stake consumes a fraction of the energy of the proof of work. What the merge means for Ethereum? The big change for Ethereum is that the proof of stake consumes a fraction of the energy of the proof of work. The match will reduce the Ethereum energy consumption by an estimated 99.5%, a dramatic reduction. However, the match won't solve all the Ethereum problems. For example, as Ethereum developer team Beiko told Fortune, it won't dramatically reduce its gas fee. That won't happen until the final stage in Ethereum massive technical upgrade, which is due at the same point next year. So let's just run through how this will benefit you. The first benefit that you're going to get is number one, um, the efficiency of the Ethereum network will be uh, about 99.5% and then there will be less energy consumption as regards the mining, which means it will reduce the energy consumption of the world by 0.2% because all mining will be taking place on the proof of stake is just computer to computer, no, no longer energy intensive. Now, the second thing is, as a result of this, um, there will be no more congestion on the Ethereum network, which means that um, the transaction will be a little bit more faster and then the Ethereum network will be more efficient. Also, this might lead to an increase this might lead to a reduction in the gas fee just as so many persons respected. One last thing is the mass adoption of Ethereum will be more because uh, the network is not proficient and since the network holds about a lion's share of the mass adoption of the DeFi system, it will make it more people, more companies, more organizations to dive into the technology and then utilize it since it's eco-friendly. So why we still await the final stage of the upgrade, this is this is time the major upgrade that is being expected on the network. So I guess as a result of this Ethereum merge, we should be expecting a pump in the market because the network is more efficient than it is to be. There's no longer slowing transaction it's very fast now and more efficient now just running as the same as the binance smart chain has been running
so you want to hit that subscription button right now subscribe and see you in my next video